Radio, ladies and gentlemen, we are live. Hopefully that helps everything. Um, go racing. Got gadget, and oh, we had another horse in this race as well. But obviously we can't ride two. We had Swizzle. They both had bad odds anyway. So it's really a big deal. But I've been playing this in a few days, so let's try and remember how I do this. Triangle, yep. Then we take the front, slow down, look over our shoulder, go down a little bit more. How you doing, Rage? How's your playthrough going? Mine's been pretty good so far. Getting back into it. Hopefully we can get um, the next file book for this one. That's the goal anyway, get that next file bread. Because uh, years are pretty quick in here, but that depends if we want to start aiming for a jockey title next. Not sure yet. Let's see how we go on. Going good in year three. May first in the oh first in Jefferson. Nice. Killing it. Absolutely killing it. Come on, Mr. Gadget. That's all I can ask of you. Good run here so far. Uh, nice, that's actually really good. Won the champion jockey title and grand prize jockey title in year two with 90 wins and a 76% win. Nice. You playing on hard, I'd assume. Oh, that's unfortunate. We have to choose between Thunderbolt and Hyperion, but we know who we're picking. And we'll jump back on Sweet Saver. Be right back. No worries. Let's get that training in. The training workout done. What are we riding on here today with you? Perf. Forty one and win. Yeah, let's do it. Hyperion. Good boy. That's going to be an excellent workout. Hopefully, the right result we needed for Group 1 victory. Forms through the absolute roof. Ladies and gentlemen, it is the time. The race that stops the nation. 2,000 guineas. 
But first, the Phillies guineas. We're good start here for Sweet Circle. Pokemon Abigail. Stream. Looking forward to winning this race would be nice as well, but the next race is so much more important. Revolution here with Sweet Circle going up the incline with just 300 meters to go. We do hit the front now, 150 to go. We do hear the sound of the whips in the background. Will we have enough in the tanks? Sweet Circle is going to pull away and win this race for us. Lovely performance here. Group one horse. Sweet circle. Lovely ride. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Give me a good pet. Or her a good pet. I thought you had a chance, but I never thought you'd actually manage it. I'm just good at doing that. Radio. Eighth pick in the market here. Goldfoot's in this field. So it's constant. So we got a little bit of got a little bit of a heebie jeebie in front of us, but that's alright. Lovely position, let's do it. Alright, let's try and get a break on the field. We want a nice lead here. So good. We've got Thomas, but in this race is ours. Good, good. I went for a ride this morning and took a different route, and I swear the idiot. My driver's tried to get the pony to follow. He saw me down the road and went speeding by. Always the way. Well, no revolution though. We got plenty of kick here. Come on, you good thing. Gonna be a group one for Hyperion. Gonna be too strong. Gonna run them ragged. Absolutely runs them ragged. That's worth a flippy flippy. Absolutely love a flippy flippy. Flippy for the bears. Five for five, undefeated. Love it. Absolutely love that result for us. Hey, basic, you've been on quite a hot streak recently. Watching you ride, I get this something staring at you. How would you like to do a little competition? Always love to do a little bit of competition with our older world. Congratulations on winning it. When you crossed the line, my mind just went blank. I don't know what that said because I skipped it, but that's cool. our horse yet doesn't really matter cool um as for the training i to do some training lucky i have a good bond with the pony and he only picked up a fast shot and held his nerve and i was able to gentle him before it pissed me off that there was plenty of time for him to slow down yeah unfortunately some people just don't care i drift right and go up by itself so time to start working on some ability 
I think I might do the Genesis method. It's like... We'll give it one crack and if we can get an excellent, we'll be fine. But this is like so touchy. Oh, so it's like... Wait till fire or... Go up two and then drop back at seven. Then we go up, drop down. Go up. Last one was too fast, but the other ones weren't too bad. We were running just on perfect up until the second fail on. But still at normal, I guess. Let's just keep doing it. Let's work it out so then it becomes easier in the long run. Alright, so I think it's like you wait till five, go up two, and seven you drop back. Yeah, it's so temperamental with the timings. Like, that's a good. Could be a good. Yeah. And that was like just in the rating for good. You got to get your first three perfect. If we can get the first three perfect, we'll be fine. It's not perfect. That one's perfect. Welcome back, Rage. Point three, point two, point one. That's like a point seven. That's not bad. The so point one, point three, point three, six, point. Yeah, it's a point eight. We'll take a point eight. We just need to get point three back. We should be fine. So you go up to four, you double tap one, two, you go up to seven, you double tap back. Okay. That should be a 14.9 or a 15. Now here, you wait till 5, 8 you drop down, you got a double peak late and you're excited, that is very exciting. I'm gonna restart that one. This one's only a normal. Yeah, double pick late will be my goal. It's the best growth type in the game. That's why I told Genesis just to be patient and wait for one. And she ended up getting one, so that was fantastic for her. So, 
we're point four at the moment. No good stuff. Oh no, point three, sorry. Still point three. Just like that, we went from excellent to good in like the space of an eye. Is it bay? Yeah, basic, but better than nothing. It's a 90... It's a 92 already though, and we still got five stars left, so... Not bad. Like the fade should go up by itself, but once we max out speed, then we'll start doing other stuff for this horse. There goes Gambled Brain right on the vet. Vets to ring about my dogs. Okay. We're not being rude, but how many things you call a rat? Uh, depends on what I need to call a rat. I don't particularly. Depends on what it is. Oh, very nice. Yeah, it's already too late to go for the jockey title this year. So next year we'll go for that jockey title, I reckon. you this week. Um, that's cool. Uh, long shot, that's fine. We're only going up against Kirby's, so. He should have been retired. But he wasn't. game do you prefer long stride horse or short stride uh that depends on the distance the horse likes to run if it's a long distance horse you want long stride because uh, they use up less energy but if they're a sprinter you want short stride because they get more strides in and it means you can get um bigger strides going in long stride is still good on the sprint but that's just personal preference going to see the million. Can you have done better than that? No. Is the answer. Otherwise I would have done better. Swizzle sticks up so we can take Swizzle stick back. Lovely. Tame, how you doing? Doing fine? There you are. Autumn Brocade. Do it. Right, Autumn Brocade, you must go to be right on Twitter in the class boost exit sevens. A different week, so. Because this is day one and this is day two. You used to be able to travel. That's bullshit. You tired ass? Why? What have you been up to? You're dropping your son off. Ah, I see. This is in good form here, so let's try and get a win, yeah? Crazy. 
It be like that, man. It really do. I know the feeling. Hopefully it slows down for you though. Like that's the worst part about it is when it just doesn't slow down and it just keeps getting worse. I don't know if that's just a me thing. going to be terrible because this horse has excitability for some reason. And we'll probably never know why this horse is excitable today. Good have a go, I'll see you when you get back. Yeah, let's go into the next week and see what have we got. Uh, yeah, nothing there, let's go next week. Ah, you came at the right time. Danny has two leads. I don't really care. What do you get out of that? Don't worry, we've got sweet circle and group one. We also have Hyperion back in a group one. We're, we're chilling. Do a workout with our boy. We also have training to do as well. We'll do the workout first. Begin. Um, Hyperion, we're in the Darby's. Here's the turtle. How have I been? Yeah, not too bad. I've been a little bit busy. Last night though, I, um, instead of streaming, I played some games with some in real life mates. So, I didn't stream last night. It was some fun. Just changed it up a little bit. Played some 2K NBA. It was a bit of fun. Won some games, lost some games, you know the gist. How most games go. Three point seven. That's an amazing score. We only needed to get a forty-one and win, and we got a fifty-three point seven. Smashed it. All right, yeah. Let's do some more training as well while we're here. Let's do some more ability. So it's like five, and then double up. Seven. We go down. I went way too slow. Right, we're gonna go with that again. We worked out the first section, we gotta wait till five, and then double tap up. Double tap up, wait till seven, drop it back down. Now that's 15 every time. 14.9. There we go, slow down, back down. Good. Good. 
Where is my controller for my lights? That means my desk, my desk has lights on the side and it just randomly turned itself on and now I'm strove and it's doing my head in. Didn't finish off too bad. Where is he? That was gonna give me a headache. How much did I play Call of Duty before? I used to play Call of Duty like every night when I was like a teen. Then obviously I stopped playing it. It's the game I used to play. The servers weren't as popular as they once were. Look at me crazy. This one, maybe? Yeah, half. Ah, uh, we'll see. He's either gonna be late or he's gonna be early. There's never any in between with that boy. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. Two, three, four, five, six. Ah, oh, it's six. I think it's six. Yeah, six. Point six. We were point one off and excellent. Oh, that's unfortunate. Damn. I've sent the um, notification to the Discord, so hopefully he gets a ping off that. That will help him come in a little bit earlier. But yeah, normally we put in the Discord so he can join in. Perfect, hold it up. It's looking good, guys. Holy, this might be an excellent guys. We finally got one. We just got an excellent. Let's go. Three perfect sectionals. Three perfect sectionals. 15, 14.5 and a 12. Let's go. Just finish all my yearly challenges. That one win in every week was annoying. Yeah, it can definitely can be. You're not wrong. But we got an excellent, guys. That's awesome. Really happy with that. Let's see if we can do it back to back. Make it wasn't a fluke. I think I've worked this out. Like, I'm not trying to sound cocky, but I think I've worked it out. Yeah, I've worked it out, lol. That's another excellent. I've worked out the sectionals. Oh, does anyone want help with their um, ability training? I think I just worked out the key. I 
That was awesome. Okay. This is going to sound really hard to explain, but there's sectionals. So... Can I do a... Why don't you do the practice ones? I can't. I can't show you, but um, I'll show you for the next one. I'll show you the next one because um, I've just worked out. It's not about up um, using the drive or anything. It's literally just um, up and down. So for the, your first 15, on the left hand side on your bracket, there's like a little timer. So once it gets to five, you double tap up. And then once it hits the seven, you drop it back one and that will give you a 15. And then for the next one, you just press it up once and let it stay there. And that'll be a 14.5. As for the next one, wait just a, like one second and then press up again and then let it settle. And then that'll be your 14. And then for your 13, get it up to two bars off full and then just drop it back when you feel like if you feel like you're going a little bit too fast and then instantly drop it back up. And then for the last one, just spam it up to the full and then slow it down at seven and then pull it back up to full. If that makes sense. I'll talk you through it next time I do it. Uh, I think I've worked that out, which makes training a lot easier going forward. that horse like absolutely just flying past us oh it's gonna be a chase up top oh that was close up the front there but whoever won timed this spurt perfectly went at the right time perle beat bubbles okay next up we have our champion hyperion undefeated this race is a little bit out of Hyperion's distance, so we will have to keep an eye on that. But Constant is in this field as well, so... My dear ladies and gentlemen. You hate Constant? He's a good horse, but yeah, he's hard to race against so early. Like... In Gallop Racer, they try and like balance it a little bit so you're not racing against super, super horses. Like Fast Navy is a good horse, but he's no constant. Where in this game, they just throw you straight in the deep end. He always nabs you on the line. Yeah. Hopefully he doesn't do that to us here today. Solo runner ability. Good morning from Canada. Welcome in, Sarah. How's Viper doing? Viper's doing well. We're already up to plus 90 speed. So I'm really excited for what the future can hold. I'm going to try and get stretch burst. I feel like our last ability is stretch burst. I know it's risky, but. We're just going to beat constant because I don't want to risk it. <laughs> Sorry for the language, but I fucking hate him until I got to ride. Don't worry about the language in chat, guys. I, I don't care. You guys can go off your rocker. I've just got to keep myself at a level so that way if um, I get to the point where I'm a bigger streamer, which won't happen. But if I ever do, then you're allowed so many F words in a stream before they get like the stream gets demonetized. But I'm just practicing for the long run. 
The Derby Cup win was an amazing. Normally it would be cruel to demand more than this, but this horse has already won the 2000 guineas too. I thought about it a lot and I've decided to give the St. Ledger a go. After the Triple Classic Triple, I wanted to take on the Prix Arc, the Trion, and become the best horse in its generation. So pretty much we're going to go for the Triple Crown with a horse that probably can't do it. Oh yeah, don't worry about swearing in the chat. Okay, what's going on here? Uh, you're doing better than anyone these days. How do you do it? Don't have any secrets. No, nothing at all. I'm just skillful, mate. I'm just skillful. Poor man. Oh, that's why they tell you about the horse. It's no good. He couldn't even stand up. I don't blame myself. He was a racehorse without the trains to deal with a real race, but. Must have been showing signs of collapsing him before, and I never noticed none of the pack country in the race. Anyone else would have noticed a horse like that getting a slow like never accelerating. He was trying to tell me that his leg was hurt, that he didn't want to run anymore, and I kept pushing him, all because I wanted to win. Enough, knock it off. You don't need to take these all the responsibility. You're not ready for this. A slow start, a bad run. If you gave up every time that happened, you'd never win a single race. His condition is my fault entirely, and anyone failed to notice his condition is mine. If you're gonna keep being a jockey, you best get used to this. You've got a race tomorrow, right? You need to forget about this. Sad boy. We, we, we'll get him back. We'll, we'll, we'll nurse him through. Well, well, basic. You're getting really good at training, horses, aren't you? They just seem to respond to everything you do. Let's continue to work hard together. Training rank has gone up to a B. Right, what do we got? Delorax. Even though it's Delacroix, but to me, it is always going to be Delorax. Nigel needs to just get a grip. Hannah. Ah, oh, I don't care about you, Hannah. What are you gonna do for me, huh? What are you gonna do for me, huh? Huh? What are you gonna do for me? Absolutely nothing. Say it again. Third pick in the market. Defending champion as well. Who is the favorite? Ooh, Gladius Royale. We need a good start and then we need to just pull back. Come on, Delacroix. Perfect. Nice. We got our perfect positioning. Now let's hope we can get the perfect balance as we sneak through the whole field. I'll show you Viper after this race, Sarah, I forgot. But yeah, she's looking wonderful. Hopefully we can max out a speed. I think I've worked out the, um... The, uh, what is it called? The ability training. I think I've worked out when I need to, like, do it all. No revolution. That's not good. This is why like trailers are bad like we're on a really strong horse here and we have ran pretty much perfect throughout and we're not even making up ground on horses that are worse than us like wow good boy though like that's a bad run but very very strange that stuff like that happens like when you're on a trailer Yeah, like really good horses from the back just get thrown to the swamp, you know. Uh, Bernie. I think it's like 500 meters. Yeah, that's, yeah, exactly. It's just like the horse gives up completely. It's so unrealistic. Got a really strong horse that's meant to be like top three and like you're trying to time your spurt so you can get a revolution like i had a good spurt and excellent potential and the game goes hmm nah oh, that's all right that's why we've bred from front runners
And sometimes like the worst make moves make the best make moves. Like it makes no sense. These are really good horses clearly, but that's not bad. Third place, we weren't even meant to finish like top five, so. I think we we're meant to finish like fourth or something. Yeah. Yeah, Algae Bra. Of course. Not the worst. Augustinius. Augustinius. Stubborn. Nah. Really don't want to deal with that. Crying Pigeon. Poor name. But Gadget's here. We can win on Gadget. So we're winning on Gadget. Don't worry about Augustinius. Let's see. Who is the favourite? Augustinius will be the favourite, yeah. Oh well, we got no pressure. None at all. Right here, let's just stay up here, yeah? <laughs> Catch me if you can. We've had some really good wins with this horse though. Like we won a group one on this horse when he was at 64 ability. 64. Yeah, not good, but I'll manage. I found a trick to get stalkers and closers to run good. Yeah, the way I normally do it is I um, get the perfect position and then I run faster than the rest of the field. So then they're actually at the front of the field when it comes time to turn for home. That's what the way I try and do it. And then you're not so far back. You do the same, yeah. So we have the same brain, which is good to hear. These great brains think alike. And that's a revolution for Go Go Gadget. Can he pull away from the field? He's got a nice little margin building here. Furlong left to run. That's gonna be all Go Go Gadget. Let's go. Good win. Very strong horse. You just get like that start dash ability is just so good because you can clear the field, settle down early. They just tie your spur and you're good. Like we we're meant to run 12th and we ran first in a group two and we've won 10 group races so that's good all right let's have a look at this horse I keep forgetting there we go so we're up to 80 uh, 94 speed we're at 1000 to 3200 i'm probably not going to do the max distance i don't really see much point but we'll start after this we'll start grinding out the uh other abilities and we'll see what we can do we'll finish off the ability and then from there on could be all good to work on our negatives. But no races for me to run in. We're going next week. They've only won two races. Oh yeah, who's going to win this one? Oh, it's a tire. Cool. Yeah, she looks awesome. Yeah, I'm really happy with how she's going. Hopefully she can keep building and if we can get her to um, her max speed, she'll be fantastic. All right, let's do this ability. Right, anyone want, that wants to learn how to do this, watch my um, bottom left gauge. Right, so you look at the lap one furlong, you wait till five seconds, you double tap up. Then once it hits seven, you slow it down. That's 15 seconds, right? The next one, once it starts, you go one, two, three, four, and then you take it up to three bars and you just leave it at three bars. Next one, you wait four seconds again, and then you just go up one and drop it down. And hopefully that should be 14 if I am right. A little bit slow, but get the gist. This one, you go up to two bars from empty after three seconds. 
Never mind, I fucked it. I went too late. But yeah, that's the gist. Once you get your first three down, it's just learning the last three. Settle. Perfect. Up. Up. Up one more. Drop it down because I feel like we're going a little bit too slow. Yeah, way too slow. You just got to go straight up on that one. Straight up to two bars. Two from top. Then we'll be fine. We had it perfect, and then I forgot the last two sections. Here we go. might have just thrown us out but the rest were perfect so now that's 0.5 i think yeah that's 0.5 see voila so hopefully that helps you guys i know it's a bit hard to explain without actually like doing it yourself but it makes training a lot easier we already have a horse that can reach 95 speed 95 ability oh, and i just accidentally clicked auto please be good uh, we'll take a normal, I guess. That was an accident. I don't even know how I'd managed to do that. Whoopsie. I oh, still have three trainings this week. Well, let's just finish this out, yeah? Yeah, I'm going to continue using it. Okay, fair enough. My brain just... When it comes to numbers sometimes, my brain can switch on and learn patterns really quickly. I don't know why it is that, but anyway. That one was too quick. That messed the pattern up. If we can get this one good, we should be fine. And we brought it back, but that's still going to be a good by point one. Point one. Or will it? Yeah, point one. All right. Let's get one more done. Then this horse is done, except for those last couple of little ones. Let's go. up, down, Double up, down, perfect. Oh, we went too fast that last one. But I don't think it's going to matter. I think that's still perfect. Point one, point one. Yeah, that's still perfect. <laughs> Let's go. And that's ability done. No, it's not. Game robbed us. Hmm. I'm just going to get drip rid of drift right because it's going to do my head in if that doesn't automatically do it. Just get rid of that with auto. And then hopefully the ability just does itself. Of course, it gives us a 
good. And we don't need a good. But with, if we don't do any more work with this horse, if we don't do any more work with this horse, this horse is a 96 with perfect distancing and all positives. So I, I think I've done well. And because it's a late growth type, we still have heaps of time to develop the horse, so I'm not worried. Now let's have a look at our racing. Those will sticks back up. Let's try and improve our performance from last time out, yeah? We'll just do the one race, let's do it. We're off and racing. Long, long shot. First mid shields in the field, okay. So you need a train spurt too, because you're going to need it. Yeah, I normally do. We are only in July, man. And because we've got a late growth type horse, the horse won't go to the races until November. So we still can train in October. So we still got like four months of training left and we've nearly already done everything else. I think we're sitting pretty at the moment. Oh, why did you drop back for? What are you doing? That might be our race done, ladies and gentlemen. We're trying to fight back after that contact, but if we didn't make contact, we get a revolution. Ah, oh, that's upsetting. And we probably have more potential left as well. Fifth, when we were meant to run like near last. Oh, that's a good performance, but that contact probably hurt our race there. We we're meant to run 14. Like, I'm happy with that. Adio, what do we got? Marshall Island. When are you running French code? There we go. Delacroix or we have Marshall Island. Give you a crack. Okay, cool. Let's try French code too. So you give me your other horse, but you won't give me French code. Makes sense. I when you get stuck in a pack and you get pack split, but you end up going straight into the rear end of the, another horse and falling and getting injured. Yep. Because I don't think they really thought about that. Like when you're trying to work your way through a field, but then your horse gets pack split for no reason. Like you're not even trying to really go through the pack, but it gives you the ability and like there's a horse in front of you when you're going through the pack and you just fall over and die. I'm not trying to be dramatic about it, but <laughs> that's pretty much what it feels like, you know. I'm just going to sneak up the inside here, save as much ground as we can. Here we go again. And we're box. And now we're not. I'm gonna use that phrase fall over and die. You you do though, like you hit the turf so hard because you ram it in the back. Like, that's a perfect example of how silly this game is with closes. That hurts. That, that's the only thing I'm worried about with, um... 
Viper. It's the fact that she's a closer. difference in boost we get from a perfect lead compared to that can be the difference between us losing and winning a race right now. Speed up, you need to be a front runner. I don't, I don't understand what this horse is doing. Interesting tactics, that's for sure. Pressure from that horse just changed the whole race for us. Oh yeah, we'll race up against constant though, so I can't be too mad. <laughs> uh nothing here. Right here, yeah, then what did we go? My parents not racing until September. You need a race soon. Oh wait, September's not that far away. Yeah, okay. Going silver again. I mean, I really don't think we worry about these horses. I feel like we wait until the um, next batch of babies come out. Right. Again. Yeah, ability went up by itself. That's sweet. So, yeah, we'll probably just do spurt. Spurt's hard. Spurt is very hard. This is very hard. The amount of timing you have to do with this one. Got to go at 27 and we're going to be at like his hip. Okay, we're going to be about here when we go. good thing. Go Viper, go! That should be perfect. I don't see it not being perfect unless it's 1.9. It might be a 1.9. No, it's not. It's perfect. Let's go. We don't need a perfect start. At least we're not a complete closer though. Like that might help us a little bit. All right. Let's do spurt again. Cause at least we know what we're doing. Yeah, 
too early. Too early, ladies and gentlemen. Just going too early, but the thing is, if you slow down and go again, you lose too much momentum, and then you don't get the margin you need. So I'd rather just restart and then go from there. thing that's I don't know I feel like we might have botched that one yeah 1.9 that 0.4 of a second makes the biggest difference and it's so annoying <sighs> that when you go it's got to be like on right on like you can't mess it up if you're going for a perfect time we went too early if we can get 29 by 500 i feel like we should be fine too far That one was, I feel like that was a little better, but was it enough? Yes, it was. Let's go. We're back on. All right. We got our spurt done. And we get a little bit of power. Um, what next? We can't, can we train toughness? What's toughness? Test. What do, we, what do we need for that? Not much. Let's just do a auto and hope we get enough. Yep. That's a normal, that should be enough. Oh, it's a good, let's go. That, that's gonna max it out. Yep, awesome. We've got three blue stats already. That's awesome. Um. Yeah, sweet. Got any races? No. And then on to the next week. We're just taking our time this year. Next year is going to be our um, crack at winning the jockey title. So if you are interested, stick around. It's going to be a busy year. But let's do it. For mouth. Um, 
Give it a crack. Oh well, we tried. Morning, Jen. I worked out how to get a perfect um rating on the ability training. I worked out the um timings. And look at our baby, she's doing good. She's already blue and she's already maxed on speed. So actually let's show you the training. It's probably a bit better in here. So we're she's a late growth type, which means she won't race until November. Which means we can train up until October. We're in August and she's already up to this point. So I don't know if I'll do the uh, extra distance or not yet because I don't know if we'll need it. But what do you guys think? Do you think we should just do it anyway? Or do you think we should max out everything else and then if we have time, do the distance? What do you guys think? I think we should just do everything else first. I think it's going to work out for us more in the long run that way, but... Nah, you don't need to touch max distance. That's what I thought. I think the St. Ledge is only 3200 and that's the only real race, but with a late growth type and being a filly, I probably won't even put her in it. So. Yeah, 3.2 furlongs is... But maybe I want to run her in the Melbourne Cup, guys. Come on. Melbourne Cup is 3600. Double... Like, maybe we'll, we will put her in the um, Melbourne Cup, you know? If only the Melbourne Cup was in this game, right? How good would that be? Yeah, I know the majors are 2400, but the St. Ledger is 3200. We'll see how we go. If we can max everything else out that we want to max out, then it'd be awesome. We won't have to worry about it. This is a fast tempo. We're running at nearly full bars and these horses aren't dropping, so these horses are either going to tire or we're going to tire. There's going to be no in between. Somebody's tiring. This is all we've got left, ladies and gentlemen. If we can't get to the finish line, that's all we got left. Fourth. That's that was a huge effort. That pace was in, like I said, it's either we're gonna drop out or they will, and we did. Win captain. Set the pace perfectly, clearly. Radio. We've got some more training to do, but we also have an important race. Oh, the scent ledge is only 29. I thought it was 32. Or am I thinking the pricks to your... I don't know. Anarchia's Prince. Let's do some more training. Uh, we could do... Slow pace. Let's just do some... Um... Oh, we could do soft as well. Let's do soft, because that doesn't always show up. Of course, you're going to give us a worst. Bad. Oh, wait. Are we going to get it? We still got it. Okay, cool. Uh, we'll do slow pace. Accidentally signed up for a 4,000 meter race last night. Oh, no, Jen. That's not good. Did you, did you do well or nah? Look at them, they've just given us three bads in a row. Based off that logic, we should be able to get a fast pace. That's good. No, four bads in a row. Worst? This game is throwing. I 
Oh well, we threw away four up there, but we got a couple, so. All right, let's do our workout. Yeah, let's go. We got fourth, that's not too bad. As long as you can change the race, even if you book it into a race, you can change the race at any point, as long as it's not the uh, day of the race, pretty much. You know, it's until you're getting ready to start the race here, that sucks. Nice. 50.3. We're nearly at our peak here, but I feel like we can win this race. It's a little bit out of distance. We're about 700 meters over distance. We are meant to run 16th. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, do I have a story to tell you? We're not giving up. I don't give no shits about no disc. Right here. We should be fine sit here like this this is a first like a far race but i feel like we have enough if we just stay at this tempo and if we can get solo and front runner we should be able to have enough stamina to still get a revolution yeah they're not closing us down so that's fantastic but giving us our ability so I don't want to up to speed, but also I don't want to touch it because I feel like we're running at a really good tempo. So. It's one. Probably give us front runner as well. Balance was normal. Okay, okay. We've got a long way to go. Come on, you good thing. Yes, that's a triple crown. We did it easy. Absolutely smashed it. We get the flippy stick out. Got to celebrate with a flippy stick. Flippy stick. Well done, Hyperion. Good boy. That makes 49 career wins, one more to reach 50. The triple crown, but for now I feel more relief than joy. That's honestly how I felt. I was so scared we'd lose. It takes years for a chance like this to come around. I was just so worried we'd blow it. But you blew all my worries away. I'm just so grateful. Having said that, is when we get serious. Keep it up for the Arc Grand Prix. What an honor to witness the birth of a triple crown horse since the Derby Cup until now. Every day felt about as twice as long as usual. Congratulations, basic. It might be hard for you to take in right now, but I think you'll be flooded with interviews, but of course I won't have hesitate to ask. Next up is Art Grand Prix. I'm looking forward to proving that this is a once in a lifetime horse. Let's see, where are we going to run you in next? Yeah, well, we're going to race you in the Art Grand Prix. <laughs> Livid Memories is going for the Triple Crown right now as well. 
Fingers crossed for our, my boy. For our boy, Jen. Wait, boy? Boy? Wait, circle. Gadget. So gadget. Wait, circle. Um. And traditionalist on debut. Oh well, you can go find the front door and slam it in your face. That's what I think about that, buddy. Uh, hey, you're looking. You're looking pretty good. Looking really good. Did it mutate? Mutated once, I think. Kind of sad. Only mutated this. Wait, did we even get a mutation? I don't think we even got a mutation. My filly in the Matrix won the first leg of the Triple Crown. And I'm confident she will win the next two because her max distance is 2600. Yeah, that sounds good. I was a little bit worried that 2200 was a little bit low to win the ledger, but it was fine. So we we're in the clear. We won it comfortably too. Just had to multi-manage our lead leagues at the end there to have enough potential to get over the line, but it seemed like we did the right thing. It helped when we have horses with really good abilities. Remind me, I have to try and activate Stretch Burst on Hyperion before we retire him. Which won't be until hopefully not this year, the year after. See how we're going. Gadgets here fighting them off. I mean, they're coming from all angles, but Yeah He's just past his peak and he's going up against some good horses. That's still a good run He's got swept late which happens Yeah, we we're meant to finish 12th Mom Balance technique increased Oh, we've got B on balance. Let's go Means we're balanced, guys. We have like a good central balance. We're just so balanced, you know. Oh wow, your form is terrible, sir. Poor circle. We'll get through this race and then you can have a break, hopefully. So Viper won't peak until she's four, but I feel like she might have enough ability in her to win a group one at three. It depends on her leg type. Her leg type could be counterintuitive. Just that little bit better, we might have got a revolution there. I like how they brought that into the game though, being like you can't just race the absolute pisser out of your horse and then expect to get a revolution, you know? And like the revolution's not going to be able to carry you. 
I like that. That's a balancing act that some people might not be a fan of, but I feel like it sets the tone because you can't just race your horse every week and get away with it. And then base like hope for a revolution, you know? Delacroix is back up. I don't even want Delacroix at this point. There's no point. We're gonna focus on the big races next week. Uh, next year, I should say. So let's just worry about them next year. Uh, let's do another one. Right, front runners and drop ins. Okay, that's fine. We got heaps of drop ins in front of runners. Let's do some more training. Um. Let's just do fast. What do I want to do with you? Fast pace is close, and we'll do that. I'm just being lazy now because I can be. Like, I probably shouldn't be doing this. I should probably do what Jen does and just save and go and save as many training attempts as we can. But I really don't mind. Um. All right, this is all we can train. We need level six spirit or level six fade. To try and do spirit. Oh, we can do this one ourselves. We're good at this one. Went too early. Must have all good trainings, lol. Yeah, but I'm lazy. I mean, Spirit's not too bad if you can get the knack down to it. You just gotta make sure you time your runs and all that properly. Like, that was terrible. I went too hard. It's perfect. Too hard, too hard. You gotta go at like 13, but it scares me going that late because you need to get like test, like textbook perfect. Thirteen point eight. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's all right. We'll get it. Giddy up, 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 giddy up. Chains, but we got it. You don't have to win this one. It, I get confused sometimes which ones you do need to win and which ones you don't. This one you don't have to. You mutter trucker. After riding abreast with a horse in front for 15 seconds, try crossing the finish line simultaneously. The smaller the difference in the time, the better the margin. Okay. So we've got to ride together for 15 seconds and then finish together. This is the one where it's like really hard to learn the timing. Oh, 
Oh, that's perfect, surely. That's easily perfect. 0 0.04, let's go. That's nearly double what we needed. Right, we'll do that again. Ah, oh, okay, just give it to us now, game. I see. We got our spirit, guys. <laughs> uh, that's actually hilarious. pulled away too much. He pulled away way too much there. That's not going to be point, one, point zero one. We're neck and neck. I'm just so good at this. That was perfect. That, that was millimeter. I reckon that's like a dead heat. And spirit leveled up again. Cool. Well, this horse is looking good. <laughs> we only need start and power, and then we have all of the blues we can possibly have. Uh, but that would probably be our last training week. Oh, you're not racing until the new year. We might get one more training. We might get one more. Constant? You're about to get beat again, buddy. Sorry, not sorry. Thunderbolt just chilling. You got us, we'll take you. Um yeah, we'll take on Sylvie if you don't want want it. No. Okay. Yeah, well I don't want your horse anyway. had breakfast now it's time to boot up my current addiction let me guess champion jockey would be that current addiction crystal goddess on debut not the favorite the favorite is serious oh not serious are you serious i'm serious serious block i had a feeling i got a feeling This is why I don't sing, guys. Remember that, yeah? Stay out of the fire. Super high level tactic, yeah? Remember that? We 
shot walks with my controller to work. Why is that? So you can play at work? Oh, look at this duel between Sirius and this horse here. A stretch burst. It's gonna come down the oh, We're just gonna gas. Sirius just too strong. to perfection yeah of course it is next we have thunderbolt we like we have raced against this horse so many times it's not even funny yeah i work in it so i pretty much don't do anything most of the day right so the man that works in it couldn't work out how to download an emulator shots fired i'm kidding i'm kidding You're kind of funny though. Because I don't use emulators. Fair enough. Well, you do now though. You do now. do now. Right, good win for Thunderbolt. And next up we have how with a long shot we have proven. We have literally proven we are better than every horse in this field. We have beat constant that many times, it's not even a constantly funny moment, you know? Where's the Hyperions in the chat? Or the Hype Squad? Is it Hyperion? Hype Squad? Hashtag Hype Squad? No? Nobody? Hashtag Hype Squad. Hashtag Hype Squad. That's it, Reg. Right, now we got our abilities. We can slow the pace down. Time to go, Hype Squad. We've got a heap more potential than we had last start. That is for sure. Let's go, Hype Squad. What a horse. Absolutely just gonna walk away with it. Flippy stick's back out, ladies and gentlemen. The flippy stick is back out. Well done, boy. Well done. I've ruined Constant's career. <laughs> Absolutely ruined Constant's career. Uh, you want me to ride Harvel? Oh, I'll bug it. Just let me ride the horse, it would be fine, but no.
I split home turn later and instant response, right? Been a while since we've raced on the dirt. Go up. I'm trying to get last corner leader. Or last turn leader, sorry. Never mind, this horse out in front is just flying. You know what I might just use the keyboard and play that is going to absolutely destroy your muscle memory you are going to be so staggered trying to play with a keyboard right yeah what do we got Marshall Island gadgets up swizzle stick Anyway, a gadget, right? Um, are you racing at next week in the mile? Okay, fair enough. think you are running around here trying to attack my position like that. that those are fighting conditions absolutely brawling after this race i'm going to quickly grab a drink because i am thirsty and i'm getting a bit hot maybe i should just take the blanket off but then i have an hoodie on still blanket over my legs because like it freezes it's here then i have a hoodie on i might take the hoodie off and then put the blanket back over just for a second both are very very safe decisions Nonetheless, hopefully we're vibing. You know what, you can go. I'm letting you go. I made that decision. a decent future. He's past his peak, my guy. What do you mean? Go Go Gadget's already won a group one. Like, lower your standards a little bit, yeah? Right, I'm going to see if I can get away with leaving my controller. 
long as that horse in front of me doesn't slow down, we we, we be chilling. Okay, I'm back. This is a crazy dream. <laughs> uh, it's fine. We're fine. We're back. With heaps of time. On the long shot anyway, so it was a sticks Paddy's day. Just did one race on normal with a keyboard and one. Nice. Well done. I'm, I'm like I'm not saying it's impossible to not win, but when you go back to your controller, you're gonna be like, what? And not with an OP horse too? I don't get the point of skipping because you can't race your horses in the time you skip anyway. I think that's confusing to me. Uh, uh, sweet circle back up. Then we have... Experience. Here we go. You're on the... Okay, you're already on the way down. Cool, we won't do our training this week because I feel like we don't need it. We're back down into our right distance. We've been winning pretty comfortably. Let's try and win one without doing a workout. I mean, Sweet Circle's done a workout. Holy. Didn't even have to do one. Riding on resources again, are you? Right, how many times have I told you this is not racing straps? We deserved a revolution there. Unlucky. It's gonna be a fall. Isn't the worst either. I think I'd be wrong. Would have been nice to win, but we won't play. We were in peak condition, but we're a peak athlete. Yeah, like we're the favourite now, we're back in our own distancing. Yeah, we're going to win this race pretty comfortably. Let's go. So good. 
We've got front runner. So we can slow down because front runner is a harder one to get. And there's solo runner. Did I get the whip ready? Ladies and gentlemen, bang, stays undefeated. A good little pat. Flippy stick coming back out for the photo as it always does. Flippy sticky. Love it. Thank you, Dennis. Appreciate it. Isn't it amazing? So this horse hasn't mutated the whole time we've been doing training. Oh, you can get that upgraded. Ooh. I mean, it didn't go up by much, but like it's better than X, I guess. Oh, well. <laughs> but thank you for the um, compliments there, Dennis. Welcome in. First time viewer? Or just a quieter viewer. Both are muchly appreciated. Let's get forward. Regards, we're on three. Yep, we're gonna win that one. Lovely. Can we still train? We can still train Viper. Like, this is fantastic. But what do we want to do, ladies and gentlemen? We could try and do the start, or we try and do power. Can we do power this week? Yes, we can. Right test run three fellings on the slope, course for 40 seconds to build up power. Keep exactly to the target time, no faster than nor slower. You'll lose points for pulling. Try and avoid this. Okay. So 40 seconds up the hill. What's that? Three furlongs, six, uh, 300 meters. It needs to be about. seconds that's not good enough that's way off that's gonna be like worst it needs to be like 0.2 i believe yeah we might just try and do some autoing because i can't be bothered <laughs> we don't need to start yeah i think power is more important for those slopes so we just put all of our training into power Hope for the best. I just wanted to give you a tip since this is episode three for you to get an excellent position front runners on the lead. Talk is on fourth, depending on the field of the size. Third is if it's a short field, fourth, if the field is fourth, nine to five. Fifteen, eight encloses, eight to nine. Field at fourteen, ten to eleven. Yeah, thank you. I played it years and years ago, but I've only really just got back into it. Like, I've got a fairly okay understanding of it but all of the help is appreciated so thank you any other tips you got just keep throwing them forward well then we've got one training left and it's in start it wouldn't be right if we don't have one crack at start surely that's why it didn't get the revolution yeah that's all right wasn't really too worried about getting that revolution in that last race um we didn't do the workout. I thought we'd win pretty comfortably. It's a good. Yeah, we'll take that. Two goods and an excellent. They'll balance out to a good. And hopefully it's enough to level up. And then that will be everything leveled up. Awesome. I think we did not touch is the distance, but I feel like 3200 is well and truly enough <laughs> for a filly. I think she's turned out all right for our second file. Let's have a look at her in all of her glory. 
right here. Yeah, she looks really good, so. Why are they running her on the dirt though for a first start? And I can't change that. I want to change attack though. Put a shadow roll on her. Put a purple shadow roll on her and put front wraps on. And... I mean, blue goes with a head still, but she won't have a head still on, which is crazy. If I change the color of her um, shadow roll, we might go pink, then go front, then go pink with black stripes. I think that looks good. Yeah. Quinn is on my list now. Lost a challenge with him and he took one of my horses. Going to steal all his horses and races. What horse did he take? I mean, which race is worth the most? That's worth 1.3 million. That's worth 950. That's worth 1 million. That's worth 1.3 anyway. Um, what's the Derby worth? Only 900. Yeah, we'll do the um, pool and cup. Uh, what's who's in the bars? Algeria, Algebra. Who's in our race? Test if I have King of Hawaii. I haven't seen that horse in forever. Very late, but already past peak. <laughs> Fair enough. I like that race. You're a Baraku? You're a Baraku. Not familiar. Alright, Marvelous Mile. Average. What do we got on the d uh, jump? We haven't done any jumps yet. I see. So you've got Crompton, who's past P. Pathologically early for Blaclaw. Blaclaw. I mean. Yeah, we're just gonna wait. Your Zora horse could daisy something. She's literally following us everywhere we go. Crystal Goddess, again. Yeah, let's give it another crack. Now, as for the rest, I think we should be fine. Right. Second pick again. Who are we? Every time we put this horse in a race, there's someone better than us in it. <laughs> All right, let's just try and get a perfect start and set it towards that. We should set it all about seven here, maybe six. Yeah, six would be good. Maybe we're good. Yeah. Couldn't quite get there. I didn't want to over push it though. Balance is way more important, in my opinion. Now we're getting boxed, swing wide, we follow the outside horse. inside, save ground, lovely so far, balance, All right, we'll start going at about 630, get on that momentum train, I, I, that's Elpis out in front isn't it? Nothing we can do. Ugh, damn. Front runners are so hard to chase down. Good run, girl. You did your best. Definitely tried. Radio, November week three. It's not telling me about any good horses. We literally just race on you and then we have to request it to take you off somebody else. Like, that's just ridiculous. Like, you're not bad, but you hate left turns and that does my head in, so we're just going to leave you alone. Right, what do we got? Traditionalist. You're not bad, early but long. Awesome. Swizzle stick. We'll race you under the ground, Swizzle. So don't worry about that. You're going to let me win the race for you, but 
That's three times you've lost now because you won't put me on the horse. Like, I don't feel sorry for you at all. Playing on keyboard is not bad. That's good. Would have been early if I trusted my gut. I shared a link in the Discord, man. I'm going to be right back. You guys can... Back in. Cool. So we've got our races. So let's go race. Uh, we are the favourite. Stretch first, spurt, home turn, leader, pack split, and grit. So we probably don't have to try and go so early with this horse. We can probably actually settle. Back. Sweeping, and we're gone. Turns out lead leg. That's going to be a nice, comfortable win. Love those wins. Those are the nice ones. That horse actually performed really well. Happy with that one, that's for sure. shot as per normal. Not the complete long shot though. Kazarika? Uh, Kazarika? Kazarika is the favourite here today. Cool name. I'd have to steal that for a That sounds fun, but I also want to race them in the horses up with bread. No part I don't like when I get back on. Good swizz. Oh, let's go. Fine, swizz. 
Let's go. 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 Glad we got up. It's about time to we got back in the winning circle. As for this race here, I'm just happy if we get over the line. <laughs> Morning Symphony is way past peak. How are you doing, Kayla? What, what would you prefer me calling you? Kayla? Or would you prefer me calling you Sara? Because you've got two different names set up. So, either I am, I really am. Not bad, thank you. Hopefully you're having a good day. Or night, wherever you're from. Pretty sure you're from... Uh, I feel alive. lie. You're from Switzerland, because of the Chodders. I'm having a mantle blank. Tara is more like for good friends. Okay, I'll call you Kale. Gotta earn my good friendship. Morning Symphony, showing something a little bit too late. A little bit too late. We'll level up our star. Oh, you got Smash, man. You got smashed. You're the best person on YouTube at this game I've seen so far. Oh, Dennis, you're too kind. You're way too kind. They don't give me a ride. What is your stats? Okay. We're just gonna pretend like you guys want me. Can we train you again? Guys, we can train. What do we do now, guys? Okay, yeah, yeah that's fair. Hi, if you do it, it's quite good. What did we train? Maybe do spurt? Like, I don't, I don't see the point in doing distance. We could just try and get level seven spurt. Just do a level seven spurt. set up I don't believe we can still train like I know that we got a late growth type it means we can do more training but I thought the cutoff was like November they call, call me surprised oh that's perfect timing let's go Oh, this has to be two seconds. Let's go. Gonna lay on the whip. I don't think I'll be able to get Wonder Whale like I was planning to. Oh, why is that? Head up, head up. Heads up, let's go, we got it. That did nothing. 
Rightio, we're gonna have to get like all excellence to get this to level seven, guys. So bear with me. That's not gonna be. That's too late. We'll go for it. Hopefully we just got a good jump on the corner. I went like six months without Gallop Racer giving me any jockey stats, so I doubt I'll be able to. Oh, I see. Oh heck, I left my earbuds in the jacket pocket and I can't lift the jacket. Just... Oh, I hate when I do that. Oh, we did it again. We still did it. Cool. One more and then we have level seven. Uh, don't, don't quit. Save state. Save state is your best friend. Save the state. And that might fix it for you. Then you might be able to load back to that state and it'll be unfrozen. I know that sounds weird, but uh, it works for me. So save the state, load the state, and if it's still frozen then. of save state how you do that go back to your emulator and there should be an option in files to save the state or it might be f1 not for this emulator i haven't but that's level seven on spur that's gonna be hard to get to level eight but i ain't going to level eight <laughs> Now, do we try obedience? Let's try obedience. What do we do? Test run five furlongs. Try to match the target time for the first three furlongs and the last three furlongs. Note that the time for the third furlong will affect both scores. The closer you get to the target time, the better the result. You'll lose points for pulling, so try to avoid this. So target time, 44 and then 38. Oh, this might be hard. That's way too fast. We've already blown the coop. Hmm. Let's just see how slow the first section is if we don't touch them. 15.9, that's not too bad. I was expecting a lot worse. Let's I think that second part's way too fast. I think way too fast. Oh. Yeah. Way too fast in the first one as well. Oh well, we tried. I mean, there's still nothing wrong with this horse at all. One bad result's not gonna do anything, you know? Right. We already had a look at our rides too. Yep, we did. And are you still racing in that race? Yeah, next week. Um, oh, poor Swizzle. I'm sorry, Swizzle. I got a race on Hyperion. We circle and Shavajero. 
Char Sarah Javo. Sarah Javo. Um, we don't need you. Alright, let's go racing. Alright, let me have a look. Give me a second. Um, where is it? Actually. File. Uh, manage maybe and go save data. No, that's just saving. Just your save manager. I don't know if you could actually. I don't know if you can actually now that I'm looking at it. I thought you would have been able to because most simulators you can. Look like you can. Oh yeah, you can. Yeah, boot. Yeah, file, boot, save state, and then you just create a save state, and then it has boot load state as well, right under it in file. Oh, I'm guessing that's a boot. So uh, that's a save state. But how do you actually? That's booting the save state, so there's got to be a way to save the state somewhere. Got to be an option somewhere for you to be able to save the state. Might be worth a Google. Google just the emulator name and how to save state and it should tell you. My weird hobby is collecting Chalets and naming them like they're real horses. The lighting looks very tempting. They were tempting to them. What are they? Never heard of those before. Is that a word for something else that I don't know the meaning of? back in the field from where I'd like. We can split this gap. Oh. Like if we can get a good run up here. There it is. Come on, we circle. Give it all you've got. Ah, nice try, girl. Nice try. Pack split, we just weren't able to come off it then. Yeah. Pandora's Magic, Algeria, Switch so Circle. Try the best. When I was little, we used to go to the beach and collect very little hermit crabs and then race them. <laughs> Poor hermit crabs. I oh, wear the easy favorite here. Cool. Love that for us. Now. Cross. down just a little bit. Um, what do you feel like? Do you want to stream it or do you want to race it? Because that's going to be like a couple of hours away. What's my favorite track to race on? Um, I haven't really picked up a favourite track yet. I have to, I'll get back to you on that one. I think... The Japanese tracks are nice, but that's just a visual effect, like Sha Tin. But, I don't know. I haven't really 
really stopped and gone, hmm, I really do love this track. Any track that doesn't have a sharp corner. Some of the um, jump tracks are unique as well with the slopes and cross paths. But other than that. It's a community horse that go up to goes up to everyone that I should stream him in the track ground or Wait, we'll get the flipper stick out in a second for our group one for three, but good boy, hype period. Ten for ten. Absolutely fantastic this horse. Bring home crabs to a rock in the shade, used to stick. Use sticks to make a track and bet fake money. <laughs> yeah, that worked, yeah, didn't you relate? Um, Sir Daniel, that is my horse. Perfect. Um, is anyone else really taking my fans? No, uh, not really. Cool. Hyperion is a unit. He's just doing fantastic for the team right now. Oh, yeah, that's what I thought. You give that horse an inquiry. Yeah, I've done jump racing before. I used to, when I first played, because I played, um, I played a heap of Gallup Racer and I've also played a heap of Group 1 Jockey. I used to breed purely jump horses on, um, uh, G1 Jockey. Once I um, get, ha I'm happy with my turf lines. I'll start um, breeding jump horses. I I do enjoy. Oh, I got the left hand. That's my bad. Um, I do enjoy jump racing. I just feel like for streaming, it's a bit hard because their races take so long. That's all. If we didn't get absolutely clobber knocked, that was so unfortunate. I'm really sorry. I'll be careful from now on. If you went into like that, that things would have been different. Exactly. Asked. I'm annoyed. That was our race to win. And we got clobber knocked. Oh, uh, so you finally let someone win a race. One for three when you could have been a three and oh. But... You know what? Um, let's see if we can get any of these. Are you a front runner? You hate large fences. I don't want that. Bikes jumping. Let's win a group one on the jump, just to show how good I am at jumping. Rome, okay. Through that, Shiba would have been like, that's your file. Oh, I don't like being behind a horse. Don't you jump badly. Thank you. Likes jumping. Love that for us. Oh, I missed that completely. But I, I made it back up. We have heaps of potential already because of that like jumping ability, so we can probably just sort of try and dictate the pace a little bit if we want. I mean, it's also risky because stamina in this game for jumping is really important. But 
also I feel like if you give up too much ground in the jump races, you, you can't win. So, try and stick with this front pack. The lead pack as some people like to call it. Especially because that's the favourite in front, so... I feel like if we can match motors with the favourite, it's going to come down to a sprint. If we catch him napping, we might be able to, um... Out sprint him. Oh, we're head and head now. Jumping good too, which is absolutely fantastic. Like, he's got to be using up extra petrol to try and get away from us here. Okay, buddy. That's so good, but... Gotta try and make our move before this jump to try and save some ground. Revolution, let's go! Get up, you good thing! First group one on the jump surface. Raid that race perfect. Let's go. I love me jump races, they just take so long. There's the flippy stick, ladies and gentlemen. Always bring out the flippy stick for a group one. Lou Clark. Fantastic. Ooh, that revolution was perfect. Love that. Awesome run. Just was a little bit worried at the start of that corner that he got that little bit of a jump on us, but that revolution helped bring it back. So that's awesome. Three year old cult of the year. Hyperion, well done. As for, uh, we're also the champion sprinter and the champion stayer. Nice. As for the Japanese horses, Vindicator, Dream Journey, Tokar Roman, was that a good year? Are you undefeated? No, you lost a heap of races. Who did you? Presto. Now the horse of the year is... Hyperion. Well deserved. Yes, it's breeding time. It's definitely breeding time. Well done. I'm happy with that Hyperion. You made us proud. Lol, now I've never ever, and I've played this game for years, had Champion Sprint be the same as Champion Stayer. Oh, really? <laughs> Time to get snacks, people. Oh, I just found out something. What did you find out, Rage? We don't get any titles, that's fine. Everyone's getting snacks because I'm going to be breeding and I'm more picky than everyone on this YouTube. I'm more picky than Genesis. I think I'm even more picky than Hyphy, dude. Okay, we'll see. They win so many races in Japan. Like, they had nearly 600 attempts. Wow. That blows my mind. That's a lot of races. I think we did, like, 30 races. <laughs> right, what else? That's it. And we got a champion 3 old cult breeder. Sweet. Little achievement. It appears that at least one of your regular rides is scheduled to retire this year. Let's take a look, shall we? Yeah. Cool. Wait. Uh, no, we're already on hard, so that's not going to do anything. Yes, let's go breed. Wait, can we train you again? No, I didn't think so. Right. 
I just wanna, I'm just curious, okay? Oh. Oh, that means I can breed with him, but I'm not gonna breed with him. I will breed with you. Now I've got him in there twice. No. I need to save over the one I already have. Right. Now, when are you racing next? Wow, there's not a group one for you for ages, so... 2.5 million? 2.5 million. Why are we not putting you in the chariot car? Worth 5 million! We got a dirt horse here, let's win the, cha the grand chariot car. Perfect distance? Five million. Last to first, rest unknown, but you should be so powerful. I wish I could change your start, because you're not even a dirt horse and they're putting you on the dirt. I don't get it. Um, when are you up next? Second. Oh, and... Can I retire you yet? Well, your owners are stupid. Anyway. Let's go, guys. Time to breed. Hmm. Low but long. I'm happy with that. Looking for a um Ooh, that's a long peak. Interesting. I haven't been breeding for that long. Stop being ridiculous. Um yeah, so we'll go you. But, Our fillies by Astrum and I'm pretty sure our fillies by Astrum and um I don't remember the name. Double peak late would be fantastic. Late. No, we've already got a horse with the exact same stats as you. That's interesting. Double sevens already. Okay. He's looking for double pick late. Yeah, that this horse has a level eight fade. What? Just casually. Look at these horses' stats in the top right. Most of them already have two. That are blue. Ooh. This horse is nearly perfect. If anyone sees a unicorn, let me know, because I'm not looking at the horse's colour, if I'm being honest. As much as it'd be cool to have a unicorn, I'm not really searching for it. Long peak's not bad either, but I would prefer a uh, double peak, like, because you can pretty much race them the whole career. 
and they don't drop off. Or if we find a really good horse with like a late growth type, I'll take that too, but... At the moment, nothing really taking me fancy. That horse had three blues. This horse has three blues. I see you, game. But look at it, our peak is 91. So we want a horse with 91 speed, double peak late. But your distance is terrible. Your fades in, your spirit's really good, your toughness is done, your power and your softness is already done, start, slow pace, and you're a front runner. You're a black filly too. But you're only gonna be a 96. And yeah, your distance is too small. Hard to turn that down, but. Yeah, it was a champion sprinter, of course, but I want a little bit of both. I'm very picky, unfortunately. To get into my stable, you've got to have a lot of um, positives and your negatives can't overwrite that, unfortunately. I had the right leg type and everything. Like I could have just made a sprinter, but I want at least a bit more speed. Front runner, double pick late. Same situation. Toughness is good, fade, yeah, but only on the turf. And then you give me a horse that I want, perfect, but no speed. Horse game. Alright, let's see, let's see, let's see. Jen, are you still about? That's not bad, but that's a lot of work. Early. I repeat early. That's the funny thing too about the refresher um, imagine breeders in real life. Mm, I'm gonna go back inside and come out with a different horse. <laughs> Every horse would be a champion. The like horse racing world would be so weird. I feel like everyone would be too picky though because everyone's doing the same thing and then it'd be just a competition who would be more patient to get the best horse, you know? Slow but long, but your obedience, gross. Level one? You're not bad. Definitely not good. Um... Once I finish breeding, we'll do um, Viper's debut and then I'll end up streaming because I've got to get up early tomorrow anyway. So if you want to stream early, if you haven't already done it that is, I'll finish breeding. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. And then, um, yeah, it depends if you've already done it though. If you have, that's fine too. Like, I don't mind either way. So the maximum we can get from this combination is a 91 by the look of it. That's with in prospect. Um, what happens if we try out um, Blanchard and in prospect again? Already had a 91. 92. Yeah, it's not really much difference. I feel like the other broodmare's doing better. 
So go back to God from and then flight race ability and go and prospect. Red horses give better stat boost to foals. Right, so you want to go flat race ability, go the crone, and then go flat race ability. Don't worry, I'll get there in the end. Go down to. Because it's just the difference, like, it's not quite there. You're waiting? Okay, cool. So we'll finish breeding, hopefully it doesn't take too long. You're good, but not good enough. I'm so picky. I'm not complaining about all these 91s in a row. Why can't you run on the dirt? You'd be perfect. You would have been absolutely perfect. Oh, you're so close. If we get Turf and Dirt, 91, and Double Peak late, we'll take it. We won't really care about the distance, because we've already got a Triple Crown winner, so, like, we've already done that. But it has to have Turf and Dirt. Then they can win more races. so close. You have a level 8 fade. <laughs> but you don't throw it. Anything else. And I want to I want to try and breed double peak late now because then you can breed it into your lines and it's a lot easier for it to pop up. Double peak late, but no dirt at all. Damn it. Oh, we got a white horse. <laughs> and double peak late. Oh, you're so close to being perfect. Bad. Your dog's scared of brooms? I mean, that's fair enough in reality. Like, that broom's like nearly the size of your dog, if not bigger. That's the thing with this part. I can just mute my mic. Um, I mean, mute my audio, and then I don't have to listen to the constant beeps. I can just play the game and focus entirely on the horse's stats. Fantastic. Hmm. 
that was a long peak, that could have been okay, but oops. Definitely going to be an interesting situation when we get the horse. We want. I want double peak early because I want a horse with longevity because then we can race them more and have more fun. That's more about what I want at the moment is the longevity. But I also want them to be able to win group one straight off the bat. Like this horse is good for example, but it's early but long. So once it's three year old years over, it's done. Like that's it. I don't want that. And then that passes that breeding on. And then you get stuck with a horse that always reduces early growth type horses. And it's just not fun. If we get a decent uh, um, double late, a late but um, long peak or whatever it is, double peak late, um, we'll take it. As long as it can run decent, I don't care about the ability right now. Saying that, I'll get one and I'll be like, no, that's terrible. Uh, but uh, you're a sprinter, but turf and dirt, please come on. Uh, my birthday is in September. Why is that? Ninety-two. We can breed ninety-twos. Look at all them blue stats. What? <laughs> Spirit, fate, toughness, and start straight off the bat. Bang. Um, you don't have to. Like, I'm just glad you guys tune in and spend your like time with me. Like, that's up to you guys. Like, I'm not gonna be that guy that goes, "Oh yes, like get me something." Like, it's really up to you. Let's try pound for pound. We haven't tried pound for pound actually. It's not helping our case of getting turf and dirt now, is it? Definitely getting some more distance. Double peak late, but can't run on the turf. Don't have to give me anything, man. I just appreciate the time that you guys spend in here. Like, that's enough for me. That horse would have been perfect if it was double circle, by the way. It wasn't double circle. That wasn't perfect. Bad vibes only, chat. <laughs> I want a cult from this horse, though, so I can breed this one to Viper. Because they're different parents. Because Viper is, um... Uh, the other filly that we have in our barn here in Astrum. So if we could go for pound for pound and this filly we hopefully can get cold or is that being too picky? <laughs> hopefully we just get lucky when we get the horse that we want that is a um, cold. But unfortunately I'm seeing a lot of good fillies and not a lot of good colds. So. I can't run on the turf at all to save its life. I say that metaphorically, of course. I just like buttery popcorn. I'm simple when it comes to popcorn. Extremely elite. Nope. We haven't had a double peak in ages. Double peak late, but nope. Double peak early. We're getting more distance from this pairing, but we're not getting the turf and dirt rating as often. Like that's. 8 horses in a row, 9 horses, 10 horses, 11 horses, 12 horses, 13 horses, yeah, we're not going to get double of that pairing, we have to go for in prospect.
And we just hope that the game gives us a miracle baby. A long peak. You're a filly. I nearly took that horse if it was a cult. I would have taken that horse if it was a cult. You're a filly as well. You're also a filly. What? Are, there's so many fillies going around at the moment. Is that just me? thing with a late growth type too, like if I get the horse I want with all the stats that I want and it's a late, I'm not really going to care too much. Like a long peak, if that was a front runner, I would take it because it's great. You already got seven obedience and spirit, but it spurts two anyway, never mind. Spurt needs to be a lot higher than that in my opinion. But I change my mind quick, don't I? Oh yeah, this horse is good. Actually, no. I looked at it again. Feel free to uh, mute the stream, guys, and <laughs> sit there in silence because, like, this beeping. Ooh, shiny, but you're a filly. Ooh. I would have taken that horse just for the sake it was um, a red. But it was a filly and it wasn't a cult. So, unlucky. Oh, that was a good late and I skipped over it. I didn't even look. Oh, double pick late. Oh, but you're a cult too. I think we found our horse. Hold up, I can put the audio back on now. Guys, I think we found our horse. Not going to be a front runner, but I don't think we need a front runner. 1200 to 2000. Turf and dirt, double peak late with obedience, spirit and fade. It's a nice horse. Oh, but it's only a 95. Nah, sorry. I changed my mind again. <laughs> I'm so terrible. Music's getting turned back off again. I'm very indecisive. I just don't, because you only get to breed once a year. So I feel like you may as well spend time getting a horse that you're really happy with. Like, I don't know if that's a bad opinion to have, but like the more time you spend here, the better your horses are going to be later, you know? There's a chestnut flex. Double peak light, but you can't run on the dirt. Of course, the double peak early Philly has decent. Spurt. <laughs> Breakfast of champions, except for the eggs. Pancakes, yes. Don't give me two fillies back to back with near perfect stats. You're being mean game. Give me the double circle. 
and then we'll, we'll be gone and we don't have to hear the beeping no more you know but instead game you want to keep annoying me Yeah, may as well take the time, yeah. Wait, what was a horse named Eggs and Pancakes Yes, on 2004 we named one. And... <laughs> so that's done. You're very nice, but you're not... Uh... Late Sprinter, Turf and Dirt, 91 Colt, but your spurt sucks. 90 Long Peak, nope. Late, nope. 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 Early, nope. Extremely early, you can just disappear. Late Flaxen, nope. A little bit long, but not perfect, no. Long peak, no. You're close, but no. So guys, get your names ready for a cult. Because I'm leaning towards a cult here. But don't be surprised if I go for a filly. Double peak late, multiple leg positions, but you're not good enough. And I feel like the deeper you go, the more good horses you get rid of, the more pressure you put on the next good horse you get, because you're like, okay, I've got rid of these horses. How are you going to beat these horses, you know? Why, game? We are not just taking her because you're white. That's racist. Real talk for a cult. Okay. We will get the number, uh, the name generator up, of course, to make it fair. But. Play it long. You have one power. Why are you gonna do this to me? Long peak. But your stats are terrible. Low pace is okay, but you're not from. I'm gonna take uh, double peak late. <sighs> no dirt. That will pick early, no. You would have been literally the definition of perfect if you could run on the turf. 16 to 2400, amazing. 91 speed, max stars, amazing. But Philly and also not perfect on dirt. I feel, I feel like the people that are going to watch this back is like a um, video have the advantage because they can just skip through this whole period until the point where we're naming a horse. That will pick late front runner. 
Double pick late. No. 21, early but long, no. No earlies, not settling for early. Don't want to name this random horse, thank you. Back. I mean, you're not bad, but no. <laughs> Double peak. <laughs> and the reason why I want 91 speed as the base ability is because if a horse mutates, it can go up to like a 94. And then with a plus like 7, we have a horse that has a 100 rating early. And having a horse with over a 100 rating this early in the game is really good for blue breeding. Because eventually we want to stop using in prospect in that breeding because we'll start breeding horses that are better. And crossbreeding in this game doesn't really do anything because they don't trace it, but I also don't like crossbreeding, so I'm going to avoid that. Yeah, if we get a filly, we'll take it. Like, there's nothing wrong with taking a filly because we can breed it to pound for, uh, pound, for pound anyway. If you guys want, if the um, game audio is too loud and you're sick of the beeping, let me know and I can turn the actual audio down separately so you guys won't hear the game audio, you'll just hear me. But let me know. So close. That horse was one more circle off. Double peak of eight, 91, 14. I think we just found it. Holy shit. Oh, but did we? I don't think, we, no, I don't think we did. No, cause you're not a front runner. And as much as I don't, you shouldn't be like, oh, it's not a front runner. So it's a shit horse. Well, I like front runners. And you don't have any spurt, so that means I'd have to work on your spurt a lot. And I ain't prepared to do that, so until I get my front runner, or you have a good spurt rating, that's your problem, not mine, buddy. Double peak late, 90. 98 though. I can't run to it. Slow filly. Double pick laid. Here I feel it. Long peak, turf and dirt. Not a front runner, but you are a cull, but your spurt's terrible. So no. Did you already finish your popcorn? Rookie mistake. Just a fatty lump? That's promising. At least it's nothing serious. It's always worrying when you have to rush animals to the vet to get scans for things. Ninety two, early but long. I mean it would be nice if we could like fluke a ninety two with everything we want. <laughs> I feel like that's a bit too um, ambitious. Seeing that we've seen like only like five. I don't really want to do this, but what is your growth type? the best parent 
I was hoping that that other horse had a better growth type or not think so we could guarantee more uh, double peak lates but doesn't seem like it being a possibility. A little bit long. We haven't had any unicorns yet though that I've noticed, which is a good start. Long peak, turf and dirt, a thousand to two thousand, front runner, low spurt. Why do they all have low spurt? No, I just have to suck it up with the low spurt. Only if we find the right horse, of course. But in saying that, some of the horses' spurts are completely fine. So I don't know why randomly on our good horses it's always low. Almost like it's sacrificing ability or something for it. Why couldn't you be like perfect? Long peak, you're close, but no cigar. get there at some point ladies and gentlemen there's a massive weight off my mind I've been worrying about it since I had the test on yeah that's it, just shows you care which is always a good characteristic to have even animals like people that care about animals are generally like some of the nicest people in my opinion if you know how to treat an animal right that means you know how to treat other people right as well. I don't know, that's just uh, my feeling towards it, but... No, I don't, I don't think you would have sent a unicorn. I mean, I'm not even looking at the head. I'm looking in the bottom left hand corner and that's it. So what I'm doing is I'm looking at the ability number, then the uh, I, once I see 91, I look at their growth type and then I go through the rest of the stats. So pretty much 91 and then check. Because 91's our peak. No, like I know we've hit 92s, but we're not getting 92 constantly. And generally, when you have a um, a peak, it's hard to get. Sorry, Gray. Um, it only takes so long because we want to make sure we get a really good horse, and I'm really picky. But worst case scenario, if you want, um, this will be left on YouTube as a video. Um, you could always come back and watch. Um, the stream next time or uh, there is a video which was my last episode which we did a lot of racing in and then you can skip through it and watch the parts you would like to watch but if you do stick around we do um, we do this thing where we throw everyone throws in a name that hasn't already named a horse and it goes into the random wheel generator and we spin the random wheel generator until someone gets their name picked three times and then that horse gets that name so it's you sort of have a chance of getting a horse name so it's fair for everyone and then the people that have already named um, get disqualified from the draw so 
you don't mind sticking around, then that might be something to look forward to, but... Yeah, I'm just... I just want to get this done, because... Breeding in this game, if you get good horses early, it sets you up so, like, good for later on. 91 long peak. Really though. <laughs> and it's, uh, it's just so close, but not perfect, you know? White Philly is very, like, frequently, I feel. I don't think we've had a white colt yet, though. You're a Philly. You're a 97, but we've already got a Philly with your stats. So close. Couldn't you have just done a gender swap for me, game? I feel like at this point in the game, like if I was to make this game again, just as a joke, I'd make the breeding system like this, but what I would do is I'd make it so there's allocated points. So for example, you know your horse is um, a 92 peak breeding those two together. So you can put your points into the horses and then you get to choose what attributes you have and which ones they don't. So say for example, if you want 92 ability, it costs so many points. You're a really strong filly, but you're a filly. You'll be right back, no worries. The next 91 double peak late with turf and dirt will take. Billy or Carl, does not matter. That means you have to give it to us, game. Late, Philly. You're late, not double pick. A little bit long coat. Not a front runner. If you're a front runner, I would have taken you, even though you're not what we're looking for. You actually had really good stats. Long peak, Philly, not front runner. Anyone slow, not double slow. Anyone. Play but long, Philly. 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 I've lowered my standards, and then all of the horses that we have passed on probably would have fit into the like barricade now. That's well, funny how that works out, but 
Like we had a 91 cult, turf and dirt, double pick late, and we passed it up because it had bad spurt. But to be fair, it didn't have it a heap of good stats either. It only had like one good stat. It's like a long turf and dirt, not for I don't care if we get a uh, 91 double uh, uh, late peak, double late peak. I'll take it because that's what we want. We want that growth type and then we can worry about the leg type next time. But for the other growth types, like say for example, get like a long peak for example, it needs to be a front runner. We just need to get the um, other objectives done. 91 and then that growth type would be perfect or a decent other one. We'll find it. It's in there somewhere hiding. Oh, you're so close, buddy. Come on. Don't tease me like that. I've gotten dressed, ran errands, grabbed food and gone back home and you're still breeding. No need to judge me like that. We've had like five good horses too and I've turned them down for like stupid reasons. I turned down a double, a 91, double turf and dirt, double late peak because it had bad spurt. I had everything I wanted except for bad spurt, but it was like a level two spurt and the rest of the stats weren't good. So I made the decision to pass on it. Uh, we're gonna find one that's better anyway, so I'm not really too worried. And we want a cult. We have had a heap of good fillies, but they're not cults. Because we have Viper, so we want to breed this cult to Viper. We also have to get the perfect horse first. Otherwise, there's no point in creating anything to We only go backwards. And I don't want to go backwards. So close to being amazing, but you're a filly as well. Never mind. I always get scenario if we get the double peak late. But what we're doing now is we're looking for a 91 turf and dirt. Um, and a double peak late, and then it doesn't matter any other stats, we'll just work around it. Um, not that close. Dog's chasing a fly? I feel like I'm chasing a fly right now. Like this game is a metaphorical fly and I'm definitely chasing it. If I was a dog, this game is my tail right now. We haven't even seen any unicorns though, Jen. We've seen a couple of white horses every now and again. Slow, double. Yeah, you got bad everything though. It's the common trend tonight. We find a good horse. It's got everything we want on the left side. Then we look at the right side and there's nothing. Like look at this horse, for example. Terrible horse. It has six, seven, six. Good spurt, but then we get a horse with 91 speed and the game's just like, nah buddy, um, we changed our mind about giving you everything you wanted. Obviously it doesn't matter too much because we can like train it, but I also want to make sure that I don't have to train too much. Otherwise, it sort of clips us back if we don't reach our um, maximum potential. I I like a lot of um, 90s now, the 91s are slowly drying up. If you were a cult, you'd be perfect. Long peak, turf and dirt, 14 to 2200. 
but light but fade eight. I wonder why I was so bad I didn't care what it said to it. That I would just read in both sets on average. This is a filly. But it's not double peak light, it's long peak. You know, like we're getting close, but we're not just if that was a cult, I would take it. But it's not what we want. Not what I want, I should say. You guys are probably over this and we're like, nah, run. Yeah, I'll still be looking for a horse. You're a, you're a trailer. <sighs> we had another good filly, but she was only, um, had one good start and the rest were terrible. And she was a long peak, not a double peak light, so. Thought I'd ruined her chances. Nah, this isn't how they all go. We're only doing this now because we're up to breeding. And because after this, we're going to do our current two-year-old's debut and we'll do the training of this horse and then that will be the end of the stream. So next episode will be purely racing. It'll be all year racing because I'm going to win the um, champion jockey title next stream. So that will probably be... I'm not sure when that will be, but it'll, it'll be before. Hmm, next. It'll either be Saturday night, which is tomorrow night, I'm not sure yet. Sunday night, not sure yet, depending on how things go, or Monday night. I got a bit on over the weekend. But yeah, and the next stream, or the next couple of streams will be pretty full on. We're going to win the jockey, champion jockey title. So we're going to be doing a lot of racing. So buckle in for that, ladies and gentlemen. I think we need to win about 70, but I feel like if we can win 100, we might aim for 100. And just race full cards every week if we have to. And if we get tired of racing, then we'll cut it back and we'll just aim to just win the title. Depends what you guys want. I'm happy to just sit here and race and race and race, but you guys obviously have to enjoy it as well. The poor game is probably confused about what I want. <laughs> Because it's given me so many different horses, it's probably like, what the fuck does this guy want? Like, I've given him everything. I've given him a slow but long. I've given him double turf and dirt. I've given him this. I'm giving him that. He just won't take them. Are you not entertained? No, game, I'm not entertained until I get exactly what I want. I'll be again. Yeah, you'll be back before the next file comes, don't stress. Settle for a long peak, but right, we're aiming for the double peak late. 91 ability, turf and dirt, and then the rest of the stats I won't care about. The main point at the moment is it just needs to be 91 ability with a decent growth type and turf and dirt. 
And not an early growth type. No way. Not settling for an early growth type. That would just set us backwards. Because breeding early out is a pain in the backside. That is for sure. Thousands over the long hold kind of now. Uh, we saw a um, 92. It's been a while since we've seen one of those. I feel like we're close. I have a feeling that we're close. Did I just call that? Did I just call that? We found our horse. Front runner, 90, but it's plus seven. The other one was only plus five, so we're going to get a 97 either way. It's a double pick late, turf and dirt. It's a cult and has three blues. We're taking it. We're done. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it comes that lovely time again that people need to put in a name for our lovely, lovely cult. I can turn the volume back up. Finally, yeah, finally. You've got the white jeans Genesis and I've got the flex and chestnuts. So let's go. So everyone, we have a cult who's a chestnut flexen. So please put down one name that you really like. I'll put all of the names kept collected into a random wheel generator. And then I'll put it on the screen and we'll spin it until somebody gets selected three times. Okay, let me get the uh, random wheel generator open because people are absolutely trying that. That's awesome. So we have Gifted Curse, Pinky Didium, Arm Paste, then we go Magician Time, ooh, that's some stuff. Yes, Genesis, you're still disqualified, <laughs> Unf unfortunately. <laughs> Uh, only one name, Didium, so it's fair for everyone. So you, you pick one between Gifted Curse and Eden's Paradise. Just so that way it's fair that everyone has one name in the draw. Um, Gray, would you like to na uh, put a name into the selection? We'll have to wait for Rage to get back too, because um, he'll, he'll be very salty if... Um, Gifted Curse or Eden's Paradise? Gifted Curse. I think Gifted Curse has a nice ring to it. Gifted Curse coming around the final turn. Yeah, it's gotta be Gifted Turn. Gifted Curse. Because this horse was a Gifted Curse, because we finally got it, and of course it was a mutated colour. So. I'm just gonna chuck in a name in the chat, I'm not going to put it in the thing, but you guys might find this funny. That's the name that I just thought of for this horse, time gone by. <laughs> okay guys, anyone else? Yeah, I think Real Talk was his. Oh, that's only three. Still only three. 
Um. Ray, did you want to put in a name? Or anyone else want to put in a name? Because we don't want to go for too much longer, otherwise we'll be here all night. Makes you think of real page from Galabrasa. Fair enough. Ready, I'm gonna have a drink while we have a little break. While we wait for Rage to come back. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. Actually, we'll give him four minutes, because then that's 1.30am. And that'll be the cutoff. So all names need to be in by the next four minutes. Let me, um... See what I can do here. So I might make it a five minute timer if I can add in a widget. Okay, well, we're running out of time, so we might just do it with three names. Makes it a fair running. Right here, guys, here we are. Last and final attempt for anyone that wants to put in a name. You've got three minutes. Got the Magician's Encore, Gifted Curse, and Real Talk. Oh yes, Elite, what name? And you can't say Eggs and Bacon, or Eggs and Pancakes. I've already got that name sorted. You've got two minutes, Elite, to get your name in. Tommy, get your name in. You got two minutes for it. We found a horse. You need to put a name in for a cult. A chestnut, flexin, two year old cult. So you need to drop a name. You've got two minutes, guys. And then we'll just spin the wheel. Think this might be the first this might be the last breeding for a couple of streams because we're going to grind what was your name last time Ali I can't remember what your name was last time you're gonna make me search it up are you venomous blade okay thank you Right, Venomous Blade. Tommy, are you there? How about drawing blank? <laughs> Does that work? Or, or, like, Rage, hurry up and get your name in. Is real talk okay? Which name do you want? Drawing blank or blank canvas? Yeah, real talk is it? Yep, cool. Tommy, drawing blank or blank canvas? And then we're spinning it because time's up. So I just need that one message back.
blank canvas. Radio. That is it, ladies and gentlemen. All names are final. No more entries. Winner will be the winner. Radio, ladies and gentlemen, we'll turn the sound off because that gets annoying. Here we go. Spin number one. It's going to be Gifted Curse hitting the board first here. Strong, very strong start. Let's put the one on there. Second spin. Venomous Blade hits the board also with one vote. Magician's Encore on the board. But don't... Ladies and gentlemen, anything can happen here. I literally had on the same wheel, I had no votes on both of my horses because we did two each on Genesis's stream. And I came back and won. I got the last three votes and won. Real talk, taking the lead here. Needs one more vote to win. Blank canvas, everyone is on the board. That was a crazy wheel spin. Venomous Blade goes to two votes on the board. It's easier to do that. Gifted Curse, two votes on the board. Blank canvas, two votes on the board. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, Real Talk. Congratulations, Rage. You have got yourself a fine horse. Now I need to change this back over for you guys. Yep. Right. I love how everyone keeps saying it's rigged no matter what. Even like when I won, before I won, I called it rigged. I'm like, this is rigged. There's no way I'm getting no votes. And then all of a sudden, comeback king activate. Blue shell inbound. Her last to first activated. Bang. But ladies and gentlemen, real talk. The winner here. Yeah, I'll, I'll name a horse comeback king after we've got through everybody just to make it fair because like we'll get down to the point where there's only two or three people that haven't named a horse and then if we want to chuck the comeback king in just to annoy some people we'll do that. What's me? It's, um... I'm back king when it's a closer. Right. We can do training. <laughs> Let's save because we made a lot of progress and emulators freeze. At least we don't have to worry about spirit obedience or fade and toughness and all that are all done so that's not gonna be too hard okay we did oh let's see what i can do right yeah let's have a look what do we got what do we got um Yep, so once we do, let's have a look. We have our own horse debuting. Don't care about you. You're having some time off. You're racing next week. You're obviously in training. You're racing in a month. Yeah, okay. So we're just going to skip this first week. I know that we said we were going for the title. Yeah, we'll make him happy because he's like... Oh, John's Coffee, that's a good horse. 
that's why you take those but um yeah so we'll do the debut we'll do the training and then we'll start grinding out for the champion jockey title so that will be probably the peak of next stream gonna be a busy year though but it's all right My memory scares me sometimes. The fact that I can remember John Coffee is a good horse just by the name and I haven't played this game since 2013. I should be a little bit worried. All right. We're going to get on the board week one with a win. It got handed to us by the uh, <laughs> Mr. Hamilton. Uh, yeah. So we shouldn't be far off. win by the way blue, i got an email from the tra Ooh, what did it say crystal goddess again good fire bar. right we got viper and we'll race on Crystal Goddess again. Hempco Racing Association. In what in the regards to what though? I see. Right, okay. Does Temco have control of my random generation, do they? Okay. Genesis is even like, yep. And Rage got the same email, damn. I haven't received that one. Must be a bit strange that you guys are receiving the email that I'm not receiving. He'll come back to us. They always do. Oh my god, it says the same thing? Are you sure about that? You just won the wheel rage, like what? Right, let's get racing and then we'll do a training and that'll be in. Yes, I know Stephanie. We are the favorite finally. They're sending over an equipment called the randomizer. Uh, what does workout help with anyway? It helps their form. So, you know at the start of the gate where it says, um, start, and then it says, um, recommended, I think, and then form? It boosts it to excellent if you do well, which means it helps you get a revolution. Like, if you look on the left-hand sides, like, the more, you get more if you get a good start. No, it helps with revolutions. So, that's why I always do workouts with my, um, horses when they're not meant to win. 
balance is bad. Are you jerking me again? Come on, buddy. Get going. Get going. My email says that Coil is adding a randomizer in the game because the wheel turned out to be rigged. Well. That's funny, Genesis. You haven't heard anything? I haven't, have you? It's strange, that. Hmm. Definitely strange. This is on hard. <laughs> um. I mean, for me, yes, but I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty good at games, but I don't know. All right, let's see how we go on debut here for the uh, Viper. Gonna switch to hard mode eventually. That sounds good. Could be a fun challenge for you anyway. Well, that was the wrong. Oh, you good thing. Yes, five par. Long shot on debut. Loving win. Arrogant much? I just, I don't know. I don't think it's arrogance. I know that I'm good at video games, so I just live. That's what I'm happy about. So I lost. Dude, you're a better jockey than I thought, basic. I had a feeling that this current crop of jockeys was rather exceptional. <laughs> so the people came up in my year were good on the whole, but there was one who was anything but exceptional. Being unexceptional is what Brian does this. Mm, you're not wrong. <laughs> oh, poor Brian. Awesome win. Let's actually put you into a race on the turf. Yeah, um... Should be fine. Good news. Cool. Awesome. Hey, basic house tricks. I've been wearing the crowds with beautiful riding just like always, but the way it seems you've got an impressive regular rides at the moment. Uh, none of them are a match of mine. You don't seem to agree? Why don't you put that to the test? Mm. That's got youth, really. Why don't you just tickle me with it too? I mean, Quick Viper could run circles around you, but that's fine. Oh my god, you unlocked free as your ability. That's amazing. We'll go Hyperion. Can. Oh, uh, why do you guys want to keep challenging me? You're just going to lose. Right. Training, then... That's us done for the time. Begin. Um, let's do left lead. Actually. Yeah. The bottom stats are terrible, but that's fine. Left lead it is. Nailed it!
got to go. Okay, Rage, thank you for tuning in and congratulations on your horse. It's him, by the way. He's got a horseshoe on his head. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I'm not being picky. Oh, I'm being picky. I'm being picky. Never mind, guys. I'm being picky. And by the way, Jen, this is how you change leads on the turn two. Yeah. I don't, I'm lazy in the races. That's why I make sure I always do lead legs first when it, when it comes to my babies, because then I don't have to worry about it because it will automatically do it in the races for me. But yeah. I don't need it, but I need it. Just a second too late. I don't need it. I don't need it. I need it. Bye. I'm definitely not SpongeBob, guys. Don't, don't, don't stress. Sauce. <laughs> Good thing, Zoom. Look at his horseshoe. That's a cool marking to have, too. Oh my god, he has a rainbow on his head, guys. Let's call it a rainbow instead of a horseshoe, because it looks like a rainbow. Start pressing it about there. There's a point. And once you learn that point, you, it's easy. It's like 10 row, like 10 lines down from the actual middle before you get to the actual bracket itself. It's hard to explain with like without pausing it and showing you, but I can't pause it because it won't stay on the screen. It's like, eh, but I missed it because I suck. But yeah, I always make sure I get these ones out of the way properly. And then the other ones later on down the track, doesn't they don't really worry me as much. But we don't have to worry about the game upgrading its turf or dirt preference this time. I pressed it late because I was holding my controller wrong. I, I'm right-handed and I was like thinking about doing the last one and I was talking it doesn't make sense it helped that I would press the button on key it's right there <laughs> we'll be here a while guys there I'm just gonna shush and I'm gonna concentrate because otherwise I'm going to do my head in. There. Better. That was actually dead center. And like you can speed your horse up in this training too, guys. But I feel like it ruins your timing because the bar moves faster. And because I've just learnt the timing, I just sit here. It's easier. Just sit straight, sit here chilling. Get my hands in a comfortable position. About there. No, it's not. It's not there. It's like a millisecond after that, basic. A millisecond, and you can't hit it. Like you got this giant gauge where you can just press it now, and it's fine. But I can't hit it. Like I'll show you guys what it looks like if you speed up. Like you can speed up to like full speed.
doesn't affect anything. It just speeds everything up. Still got a good though, but yeah, it just ruins your timing. In my opinion. Then I get a bad. I should really be sleeping because I have work in a few, but I'm like hanging out here. Yeah, that look, that's a decision you have to make, my guy. I mean, I enjoy having you here. Everyone else enjoys having you here too, but you also do need to sleep. I do that all the time. Like I've said the last few streams that I should be in bed and then it's 3.30 and I'm going to sleep at like four and then going to work and driving all day. Yeah. Yeah, that is timing so speed up with the whip I see that could be a plan Good call there, did Very good call. Never mind, because I'm... It ruined... I don't know, I felt like that ruined the timing, but I don't know. Like here. I get it at most times first. Very pretty horse. Right, this one's the one. There we go. Done. Done messing around. do um, focus because focus is easy as I feel like it's very easy I don't know is that just me you just watch him I gotta focus so right, let's go nailed it you just see you just watch his ears that's what I watch anyway As soon as they disappear, you just correct the focus. Like that. First try. Lovely, 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 lovely. We're a front runner, I so said we'll do rear. Actually, you know, drifting would be more annoying. Again, make sure you're paying attention. Go up, slow right down, all the way down. Wait till you balance, then speed up to half or wherever you need to so you maintain your positioning. I like to start moving over a little bit until it starts blinking to give myself some room. So when that horse moves, you can move over with him. And that's how you do that one. I wish the Gallup Race Road 4 had some of these training modes for more immersion with your horses. I agree. I love this. Like, yes, it's fun having more horses and whatnot, but this is also fantastic. Like, this one-on-one -on -one time, you get to feel like you're actually putting in that work to get a really good horse, you know? And then you, like, learn their characteristics, what they do right, what they do wrong, and it's fun. Definitely fun, I love it. And I like it's a skill to be able to do this sort of stuff. Like it's obviously not everyone's cup of tea, but there's ways around it. That's for sure. Like you don't have to do the training if you don't want to. It just helps if you do, you know? I 
can't remember if we need a win. So I'm just going to restart just to be safe. Because I don't read things. There's too many different ones. Yeah, we got a coal. There we go, that's a perfect training week. It's a cut will be the rep best racehorse ever, Ellie. <laughs> Hopefully, fingers crossed. Adio, so that was actually really successful in the end. So real talk, our new cult, we got our double peak late. We have freeze and ability on a front runner. So that's really interesting. At least it's already activated so we don't have to worry about it though. Um, and we got rid of focus, drift left, right, left lead, right lead. So next stream we'll work on front, rear, excitability and being boxed. And then we'll slowly start weaning out the rest. But yeah, I think that's going to do it guys. Because I think Genesis is about ready to start her stream. Here's the proof guys that I'm playing on hard with everything enabled. So a little bit of proof in the pudding there for you guys. And yeah, it's been fun. It's fantastic. We're able to win a amazing amount of races with this boy here he's undefeated won the St. Ledger the Derby the Guineas the Trial Stakes the St. Ledger the Art Grand Prix and also the like the Jockey Cup Mile and also the Cool One Cup so we've won six group ones now so absolutely happy with this horse I changed the start in 15 minutes to give people a break if they want to switch okay cool that's good it'll give me some time to feed the puppy and stuff as well yeah, if you, if you guys are new to this community, um, Genesis also streams multiple games at the moment. She's back in the streaming mode. She does have off periods every now and again, so don't get on a case if she's not uploading. She comes back eventually, just give her some time. But if you could go drop her a subscription, that would be muchly appreciated. She puts in a lot of work into this community and into my community as well. And she's a lovely person. So please go drop a sub or even just watch the stream and have a feel for her streams yourself. But that's probably going to be me done, guys. And next stream, the grind begins. We're going for 100 wins. If we decide we get a little bit bored and we want to cruise through, we'll just try and win the title because at the moment we're in fifth. So... Anyway, guys, it's been fantastic. I've had fun. Hopefully you guys have had fun and I'll catch you in the next stream. Peace out and catch you later. Bye.